Last week we took you through the Esijeni village walk, the amazing sunset safari ride. Bushlebetu was invited for an overnight stay at Mliluane. We definitely got a good night's rest and a good night's sleep is important to helping your body function at its best. Sleep also helps you function effectively through the day. And this is why we were able to wake up at the crack of dawn for a peaceful, serene walk. Our guide took us from Liluana Rest Camp and guided us along trails focusing on the diverse habitats in close proximity for great sightseeing, including woodland, grassland, forest, and aquatic species. The color yellow is the Timana is around here, the Mali Tigers. Like our story is right. So that's why it's not terrible. Because they do what we call wallowing. They roll in the mud. That's what we call wallow. So mm. if it's too hot, they do that for two reasons. Either to take off ticks or parasites. And mm -hmm. also to control the body temperature. Mm. So, I don't know what to so why are you going to They need to be covered by the mud. They need to go and find tree or scratch or that's because they do the wallowing. Then nothing the new log man name. Then they say, Yeah, you're from a little scratch. Good question. An animal track is an imprint left behind in soil, snow, or mud or some other ground surface by an animal walking across it. Animal tracks are used by hunters in tracking their prey and by naturalists to identify animals living in a given area. Okay, from the tracks that we have here, there's the oldest one, which is this one. Yeah, this is the oldest. This one is a bit fresh. This is not a It's a tomb. This is five because we saw it. This direction is the shape yellow. And the track is the spigale. This one is the picture because they are adapted to outrun predator. How do you see if it's too old? There is wind. And so, when they get up, they Now, when they get fresh. It tells you okay, let's do an and it's done in But look fresh, we are else it's fresh. So we can still track you and find you. But this one we can say, Sabi is a bear. But in India, it's not a chiga. It's a sabi guide. So we have to track a lesson. This one is fresh. Go to Bona Nanda, go in. It was now hamba. Now hamba, go in the gana. Lom Saba, we have to make a direction. Go to see, now hamba. We have to push around and let be. So the same applies. Now, La Gunja, it was, it tracks the foot. If you have to push then you have to push Because to that's how you survive in the bush. Understanding how genes and the environment come together to shape animal behavior is very important. It is important to understand animal behavior because it sheds light on us as human beings. Maybe one good thing in Thailand, it's a territorial call to tell the other. They are, they are always going in pairs. But the the couple are the only one who is 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 the only one who
hero who competed. Yeah, yes, he first to make the call. And then the other one will reply to show his eye. I mean, call and repeat it throughout the night. So if one dies, but of an attitude? Yes, that would us then suspect it. Say, that would be a tough, it would be enough for me. I eat for a long time. I feel it. You have to decide. I'm just moving in there. I'm not going to love that one. Okay, I'm not going to love that one. That's this one I have here. <laughs> when we returned from our walk, Mlilwana Game Reserve was buzzing and filled with cyclists from Eswatini and outside the border. Yes, you guessed it, it was the annual Nedbank Invelo MTB Classic. As Bushabethu, we couldn't believe our luck and we did nothing less but to cover the event. Nineteen. <laughs> classic for the past 10 12 years riding race after race yeah yeah basically what I'm looking for is to enjoy and have fun it's quite adventurous yes refreshing refreshing as well very very true it's more more fun you experience new things every year the route by Shinja every year quite challenging. You enjoy yourself more than anything else, and yeah, yeah. For you, I'm going to tell you how to next year. Yeah, I'm going to tell you how to ride next year. I'm going to tell you how to ride next year. I'm going to tell you how to ride next year. I'm going to tell you how to ride next year. Sure, my name is Jess, I'm from the UK, um, but I live in Mozambique, just over the border, and this is my first year doing this race, actually. Okay. So I'm excited to see what the route is like, but I know the, the park, and I know how beautiful it is, so I think it'll be a nice, a nice route. All right, Wait, what are your expectations? I think I'm going to get my ass kicked, because <laughs> it's really far and a lot of climbing, so um, I think I'll be really tired by the end. Okay, okay, alright then. Best of luck, yes. Yeah. Thank you very much. Alright, uh, fitness. The race was officially opened by Minister of Environmental Affairs and Tourism, Mr. Moses Villagati. Netbank, please keep it up. Thank you very much. You are you are a star. Uh, if if uh, if only um, we could multiply you. We, we know that uh, the, the country could go from strength to strength, and that's why tourism is concerned. Thank you very much. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the United States of America, Subabo UK, Subabo Germany, Subabo South Africa. From a tourism perspective, see by converging place. 
ngoba bonke labantu bandizele besukele bedala sebefike bedala kithi lokho ke kusiniketa lithuba lelihle ukuthi sithi makethe ngoba live liyawatiwa ngokuthi bantu bedile kuwe lokuthi akwabo ke la sisiyathi ukuthi kusasa sebathi awudana labanye nalabanye namhla nje laba la labathi awugibela lama bicycle eh baye bethe abafika ku about 500 lokho kuyakhombisa kokuthi lesasa saliyakhula and basitjela ukuthi ngeminyaka ngeminyaka kuyakhula kuyiwembe and, and, and nansi siyatibonela ukuhle ke futhi sibona nala abantu bajabulile ngoba abantu nabefikile bajabula sebathi awubona netilwane from a tourism perspective sesiyathi nje ukuthi imlilwane sekumalula nyalo kuyimarket ngoba abantu sebabonile bathi awuhamba bobuke letilwane nanami nje sengawubona tilwane nyalo la eh nokushumineke nge domestic tourist bona ke bele bakhamkale ngaphandle ngisho ukuthi ngena i domestic nale external tourist ukanje kanye nako lokusijabisa kakhulu namhlanje siyathi bongela kakhulu sibongela ku net bank sibongela nabo bonke labendele umsebenzi waba imvumelelo ngoba naye net bank abenge katendele siyabona ukuthi kunala manye ama partners sithaba qhubeke nje bayembili sithemba ukuthi nasemnyake lodaka ba tawanza gena seyanze nelive long sithi vele nje lapha wonke 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 ungathi ngabe udala lolu swati naye athi ujoin abe incenye yale naye avuke avakashe Invelo MTB Classic is a netbank Eswatini sponsored initiative with the aim to become Eswatini's MTB event of the year by being an efficient well organized fun event with the highest ethical standards and to also raise funds for community and conservation projects linked to big game parks but mostly to showcase Mlilwane Wildlife Sanctuary as a wonderful outdoor destination for families Okay uh, first of all ngicelanje ukuthanza kubonga onke masecyclers ethu lasifikele lamuhla Invelo yaqala sesibeke umnyaka we 9 yalo yaqala yaba ingulube and then we changed it to inet bank invelo uh, invelo it was a way to give back to the community that is surrounding imilwan so every money that we get here we always try and do a community project uh, that is surrounding imilwan and that is uh, money that we get from our main sponsor which is net bank and also our supporting sponsors as you can see from behind okay uh, invelo for us later la lenda ngayo nje i can just uh, name for now uh, but we love the challenge just for the cycling uh, having people coming all the way from Mozambique from South Africa from USA from the UK from Germany so for us that's a way of actually see as a good exposure and then bringing in people coming through to Eswatini and as we're looking right now Banu they are done with their cycling and they are getting the opportunity to see Bab Kubega Babuga Mlilwan and enjoy the facilities of Mlilwan which is a draw card in regard to tourism because by the time they go back to their country they have experienced Swaziland they had an activity which was good for their help at the same time but enjoy your world life and also see on, the like friendly people of Eswatini so that's what it does for us in regard to tourism with the with the change of the years in Yalo say it's bigger it's bigger and in Yalo say I understand there what we mostly focus on in Nimvelo it's more of a family at the same time it's a more competitive uh, race so in Yalo what, what it's doing we are having more families coming through with their kids to spend time here and then we're bringing in people from different countries so ngakhamba kwesikhathi ama entries zethu ayanyuka and we're just praying in the near future because we get even more to a point because we surpass the entry levels that we normally have which we normally put it at 500 and this year we're looking at like 450 7 plus so for us ya khola um i would advise the maswati who say they must come and join us they must come and experience this event it's an amazing event and it gives you exposure to communicate with other people that are coming from different countries at the same time we need that opportunity to use our facilities that are within our country so i'm just advising them and it's affordable you can come through and, uh, and just enjoy being at mlilwane okay my name is mongsane zwane i was doing the 35 k's Um, it was a good route o- overall there were no problems with the route well marked um, I, i enjoyed the race it was a great race my name is malik mcnamara ish i was doing the 22 kilometers uh, the race was very difficult i enjoyed it hello i'm phoebe tyson i i'm just came back from a race i did 12 and a half kilometers Hi, I'm Kathleen. I'm from just the other side of Jeffrey's Reef in South Africa. Kirsty from Eselwini. Mary from Ongoban. And Alison from Malkens. Malam ngi ngikho sihlamini. So we are Eselwini. Eh timini yakho kusekhaya cycling club. 
Jablila Gubala and Anamul. Hey, but I beg tough man, hey. Bang a single load. All right. Can you tell me who you are, where you're from, and what brings you here today? I'm Khatu Kuwe Spiens. Um, I'm from Kumasi Port, um, Pumalanga from South Africa. I um, they bring me here. It's a love. Uh, I hear for many people. This is a lovely race, and it's very awesome to ride. Mariana Abrams. I am from Mantenga. Um, I'm here because I just love the fun, the adventure, meeting new people, being in nature. I mean, this particular area of our country is one of the most beautiful and with the natural wildlife the animals it's just hi my name's uh, james wilson and uh, what brings me here oh, i guess mountain biking i really like it and this is my fourth or fifth time here in uh, milwani at uh, the at the Invelo event i think today i did the 35 kilometer race and that was just about enough in the previous years i've done the 65 and I've learned not to do it. <laughs> the, it, it oh, it's a great event, I really like it. I think the course is really challenging. From the, cha the courses in the region, this is probably one of the most challenging, um, not only in Swaziland, but also in, in uh, this side of South Africa. And that's good, I like that. I like being pushed a bit to the limit. For me, the 65 is a little bit beyond, but that's just my, you know, I know, I know how far I can go. But uh, the 35 is it's good fun, I like it. But it's definitely good when it's over. There are times when you're doing it where you think, what on earth am I up to? But anyway, here we are, we finished again, and uh, I can already see I'm going to do it again next year. I was in the 22k family run. I came with my husband and my son. The expectations were really to have fun, to enjoy the nature, and it's, it's really been brilliant. Um, at some point, it was really hard, and I thought, well, this is really tough. It's grueling but it's brilliant. It's amazing, the water point is amazing, the place is amazing, I love it all. I really enjoyed the race. Loved it. Great ride. Fantastic. Uh, it was awesome. It was a nice, uh, fairly easy ride. Some of the hills were a little bit tough, but on the whole it was fine. It was really good. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I was joining and I was going to have a good time, but I know for a show me some team, but no involuntary. Like cool. uh, ladies, come and join. It's fantastic exercise. Easy on the knees. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And it's a great exercise to have as you get a bit older. Okay, I'm a go go and I, I love doing it. It's just so, it's such good exercise for me. And we have lots of laughs. We've got a Sunday social ride for any age, all ages, and we always have lots of laughs. It's safe. Um, yeah, I can recommend it. Get on your bike, get fit. I race by 37.5, but I'm going to now, I'm going to go to the hospital and go to the hospital and go to the Well, I mean, I quite like the place. Also, my daughter was at school here for a bit. Uh, so I have some friends. I have some friends from the mountain biking community. And it's a very friendly environment. And this place, particularly Mulwani, you know, it's, it's a very great, it's a nice place. It's, uh, it's well run. And um, well, I just like it. It's nice. It was fun. It was difficult. I cranked my butt off. My legs were burning, but it was amazing. I fell twice, and it's excellent. It's part of the adventure. I was in the next year, and I was in the next year. I was in the next year, and I was in the next year. I was in the next year, and I was in the next year. I was in the next year, and I was in the next year. I was in the next year, and I was in the next year. Especially in 37, and I was in the next year. I was in the next year, and I was in the next year. I was in the next year, and I was in the next year, and I was in the next year. Yes, most of us very long as long as guys now claim you very long. Said it. One man is excellent two weeks, so I lose. Already so late, no one to call it Louisa last year. Oh, you have to do it. This is a spectacular event. The, 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 the landscape is like nothing else. It, it is challenging, as I've said, but on the other hand, that's mountain biking, and it, there are mountains. It's the real thing. Um, there's no beating about the bush. Come and do it. I would say as many people as possible should come. It's a very amazing race. Um, 
places in the kingdom. So please say that for us. It's Shomangwane. Shomangwane. Vuga Uvagashe. Vuga Uvagashe. Mbukati, that marks the end of Invelo Classic 2019. Lomnyaga, <laughs> Fisan